Hi guys, welcome to another electronic clinic video tutorial. In today's video tutorial, we will be using the differential up contact and we will also be using the increment and decrement functions. The increment and decrement functions are most commonly used in industrial manufacturing processes for counting the number of items or products manufactured per minute, per day or, or per month. So let's start programming. Open the Win Proletter software. Click on New. Now first select the type of PLC you are using. The one I am using is FPS 14 MA. Click OK. Now select the differential up contact which is this one TU contact. Simply press U on keyboard and write x0 or any other input x1 x2 x3 x4 whatever so i'm considering x0 let's suppose that the sensor the infrared sensor is connected to the input x0 click enter now we need the increment function so for the in, uh, for, for the function you can simply click over here and click now over here I need the increment so simply write I and C click OK now it's uh, it wants the uh, destination so I will select this zero and click OK now PLC Simulation, PLC, run PLC. Oh. On. Oh. On. Oh. So that's how we can count. Now Let's make a table and uh, store these uh, values. Click on the register table, click add register table. Table name, it can be like, uh, for example, uh, x, y, z, any name. And table starting address is d0. You will select the fixed length and uh, I need 20 locations. So this is a table and click OK. Now this table is available over here. Now simulation right yes and run. Okay now if you see let's check this. Now you can see that at D0 we have 3. Now let's use the decrement function. Again click U on the keyboard and uh, X1. That's for example another sensor is uh, connected on X1 which decrement the value. So simply click F on the keyboard and write DEC decrement. Click OK. And we will give it the same memory location as D0. D0. Enter D0. And F. And OK. So simulation. Yes. Run PLC. So if I click on this one now we can use the move instruction which uh, uh, we will cover in the coming tutorials that how this value can be transferred from this uh, memory location to 
another memory location for further uh, processing and this is a table from here we can check so that's it this is how we can use the increment and decrement function and these are the most commonly used functions so if you like my video please subscribe to my channel like my videos share my videos with your friends and thanks for watching